Shalom v'racha from Yerushalayim, Yer HaKodesh. Our mission began tonight uh, at the Mizrahi building. We heard from uh, John and Rachel Goldberg, Poland, uh, about Hirsch and about the other hostages. And uh, we were zochim to come to the Kotel tonight to Davin. When we opened the mission tonight, I pointed out that today in Chutz Laaretz still, and earlier today here in Yerushalayim was the third day of Adar, which is actually a very important, although mostly forgotten day in Jewish history. According to Sefer Ezra, Parak Vav, it's the day when they finished building the second Beit HaMikdash. And whereas the first Beit HaMikdash was built with great exuberance and fanfare, the culmination of a 480 year process, which began with Yitziat Mitzrayim, the second Beit HaMikdash was built against the backdrop of loss, of exile, of suffering, of collapse. And that rebuild required a lot more effort not only in terms of the building process itself and the political dimensions of it, but also from a spiritual perspective. And uh, pointed out that in the case of the second Beit HaMikdash, it really had to be people who were Shavet Tzion, people who returned to Tzion uh, from Chutz Laaretz, who were engaged in that work of rebuilding. And uh, Yehi Ratzon, though we are today still in a very challenging period for Klal Yisrael, uh, we are here to give chizuk, to get chizuk, um, and the Goldberg Poland Mishpacha said as much tonight, um, and we hope that we'll be zochim to do so over the next number of days uh, in the uh, in this uh, joint or Torah kins mission. Erev Tov, Mir Shalayim, Yer Hakodesh.